The operation that started on Sunday was carried out with the assistance of the Namibian police to ensure compliance and law and order. NASCAM's Regional Coordinator of Artists for Kavango West and East Regions, as well as Zambezi Region Erastus Muruti, led to the operation. The aim of the operation is to clear music piracy that has robbed local artists of thousands of dollars. Many artists are not happy with what is happening to their music, which they worked hard to produce. We are taking much of our time to do music so that finally we may uh, release our album and people or the community to support us. But now after releasing the album and we want to sell, we put it on the market to our sales manager or the person who is uh, distributing the music around, you find that it's only sometimes two, three copies that are bought. And out of that, we make a loss, you see. So we want this to come to an end so that we can at least also do our best release music again and again and also for our own uh, benefit to take care of our own kids. For example, you go to a studio, one song, you pay 1000 And designing it, others they do 850, others they do 500. But still, when I'll come back home, I'll have to come and sell the CD on $100. So if I'm having an album of 15 songs in the city, I want to and I come and sell the CD on $100, how much am I getting? Many computers and other music string devices were confiscated during the operation and were only returned after the perpetrators paid fines. All places that were visited were found to be playing illegal obtained music and were fined $4,000. Muruti says several warnings and fines were given on Sunday and will continue making sure that copyright is respected. As we are speaking now, there's no arrest yet. Since some people are running away from the arrest and they left their devices unattended, and some they are claiming that they, 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 the jukeboxes doesn't belong to them, the owners are not even in this town. Mm. That's making the situation impossible. Then we'll end up confiscating them and until the owners come and report themselves to come and tell us how are they dealing with this pirate, who is providing this. We found one of the machine which holds a figure of 70,506 Namibian dollars. All that from pirates music. And that there is no escape on that one. It is arrest to will be conducted for that. We want to clean the environment. We want to clean the piracy. Let our artists at least feel happy and eat for their own sweat. This is the second operation in the Zambezi region against music piracy after the 2017 operation. Muruti said many people are illegally downloading music at the Katimamulila open market and at bars and shabins, as well as at Chinese shops. <laughs>